Okay, villagers. Today we will hold a contest between you for the best tree drawing. Which of you will draw a tree drawing better in a certain time? Will receive a prize in the form of emeralds. I have provided everything you need for this. You have cans of paint and brushes to draw, so now you will start it. Let's see what will come of it. Of course. No problem, JJ. I've been preparing for that day for a long time. I'm sure I'll be able to draw an amazing drawing and it will be much better than another villager's. Let's see what happens. You'll see for yourself, JJ. Okay, I get you. I see you've been preparing for this. Let's see who gets a better drawing. I hope for your skills as an artist. I think each of you will do a good job if you want to win emeralds. In that case, you have to try hard because this is not an easy competition. Yes, that's right, JJ. Don't worry, I'm sure I'll do fine because I've been drawing for a long time and I'll definitely be able to depict a very detailed and cool drawing in a short time and get my prize in the form of emeralds because I love them very much. Okay, the competition starts right now. Start your drawings. Hey, this cute kitty seems to like our contest as well, okay? I won't distract you. I see you've already started doing it quickly. Let's see what happens in the end when time runs out. And so let's see. Hmm. Stop, who is that walking there in the distance? Huge and green. Stop, it didn't seem to me. Or my eyes are lying to me. It's Mikey, and he became a big jock. But how is this possible? Hey, Mikey, what happened to you? How did you become like this? Oh, yes. Hi, JJ. I got a little pumped up. I was walking around the village today and came across pumped up guys. They were doing sports. They invited me to work out with them and that's what happened. I became a real jock, but I don't want to stay forever in this body. And what do you do with the villagers? Oh, I arranged a drawing contest for the villagers who will draw better will receive emeralds from me because they love them so much. Do you want to take a look? But before that, tell me in more detail how it happened and what you did. And so, Wow, stop what it is. I haven't seen this yet. It's like a real gym, and there are so many real jocks here. I also want to be like them. Whoa, hey, hi. Your name seems to be Mikey. We know you. We see that you are interested in our gym. Yes, we are swinging here with the guys because we are jocks. Join us if you want. We have absolutely everything you need for this. Wow, seriously, guys, I'll be glad to try this. You can see that you're really cool, guys. If you don't mind, I'll join you. I'm surprised how quickly you were able to build a small gym right in our village. It looks really very cool. That's right. Take this dumbbell. We have a lot of them. Let's see if you can handle it all. We also have barbells and treadmills. If you like everything, how about trying to hone your punches on a punching bag? Amazing, guys. Very cool. I'll try everything you have here. I'm sure I'll also be able to pump up and become a jock like you. It will be very cool. Oh, yes. I'll try to hone my punches on this punching bag first. It's pretty hard, but I can, and I'll do everything to get pumped up as soon as possible and become like these guys. Oh, yes. That's how I became a jock. I think now it's become clearer to you, JJ. It was really not easy, but amazing. Okay, Mikey, I get you. It looks like you really wanted to become a real jock and you did it perfectly. Okay, let's go back to our villagers. It seems they have completed their drawings right now and are waiting for the verdict. Hmm. Hey, Mikey, evaluate their drawings. Whose drawing do you think is the best? Who will win? Come on, JJ. Look at our drawings carefully and choose the best one. I'm sure my drawing is better. I've been working on it for so long, it has a lot of details and it's really great. Yes, that's right, villager. I think your drawing is the best. You won all the emeralds. You can be happy. You are a very good artist. Do you agree with this, Mikey? Yes, I think his drawing is better than the other one. It's really beautiful. This tree is very detailed. In such a short time, he can pick up his emeralds without any problems. Hooray. Thanks for the win, guys. I'm so glad my favorite emeralds. Oh, yeah. Okay, JJ. What should we do now? We need to get my body back somehow. You don't have any potion or something like that because it looks like I can stay in this body for a long time and I don't want to. Hmm. I think I have a potion. It's lying around in my inventory somewhere. I'll try to get it. It's a returning potion. It should return the body to its normal state. Look for yourself. Wow, everything seems to have worked out. Stop, Mikey. Look at this. How is this even possible? It looks like the potion got on the cat. But why did it become realistic? I'm in complete shock. It looks like it was originally real, but turned into a cat from our world, my god, Mikey. We have to catch it and return it to its normal world. Hey, it seems he's trying to run away from us right now. It seems he's trying to run away from us right now. 
JJ, I'm going to try to catch him. He's not going anywhere from me. Hey, cute cat. Wait, we have to catch you. You shouldn't be here. Stop right now. Oh my god, how fast and nimble he is. Mikey, I'll help you. Together we can catch him. We need to drive him into some vulnerable and small space. Where he runs at all. We urgently need to stop him. I shouldn't have thrown a potion at you when he was standing next to you. Now it's a realistic cat. I'm shocked. Look, and there's a real portal to another dimension opened. What's going on? Rather, this real cat can jump into this portal. What should we do now? Hey, cat. Wait, don't jump there. Whoa, Mikey, he doesn't seem to be peaceful. He's aggressive. Don't touch him. He can attack you. He's become dangerous. Just watching him, I hope he doesn't jump into the portal. Oh, no, he jumped in there. More like right behind him. One hour later. Oh my god, I'm in complete shock. Did we really jump into the portal? Hey Mikey, where did we end up? Hey, it seems everything didn't go according to plan. Look there, it's a real cat and he became huge in this dimension and we became small. How did it happen? I'm shocked, JJ, because this is the real world. This cat is really huge. I think we have no choice but to jump on it and ride it. We should try to catch it. Maybe together we can do it. Let's try. Yes, I think it's a great idea. This cat is huge. I think we should be able to do everything. As soon as he gets closer to us, we'll jump on him and saddle him. I hope everything will be okay. I've never seen such huge cats in my life, especially from our world who have become like this. Okay, JJ. I think now is almost the right moment to jump on this realistic cat. You need to make it in time in case he wants to run away from us. So far, he is not afraid of us because we are much smaller than him. Okay, jump in first, Mikey. I'm right behind you. Oh my god, JJ. We really jumped on this real cat. We saddled him. It's so really cool. I'm shocked. We managed. We continue to control him. Then we'll need to figure out how we can steal him. He's trying to resist. Oh no! Don't worry, Mikey. So far, everything is fine. The cat continues to run all over the real house. I have never straddled real cats in the real world in my life. Keep holding on tight to him. Yes, I'm doing what you say. It's really not that easy. This cat is very fast and nimble. And because of this, I can fly right off it. It's not as easy as you think. It's difficult for me. We will be able to come up with something. If we manage to end up in other rooms, we will try to find portals there to get back. In our world, we have to stop this real cat at any costs. Okay, JJ, we're already in another room. Apparently, this is the kitchen and another part of the house. Look for portals here right now before the cat throws us off his back. Yes, I'm trying. It's very difficult. It shakes me a lot. Oh, yes. Today is a wonderful day to build a new house where I will live. It is almost finished. There are only a couple of stages left and that's it. Whoa, hey, Mikey. What are you doing here right now? It looks like you're building yourself a new house. But for what? It looks like you're very passionate about this process. Yes, that's right, JJ. I decided to practice building houses because I will participate in a competition among the villagers. Whoever can build a starter house in the minimum amount of time will win a prize as an emerald truck. And I hope to win. How do you like my house? How would you rate it? Wow, Mikey, that sounds really cool. I hope you can win this contest. And so, your house looks pretty enough. I think you should definitely participate in this competition. How much time did you spend building this house? Hmm, it seems like in two hours. I still had to get the resources for this house. And it seems that I'm missing a little. Hey, JJ, do you have some brick blocks so that I can complete my wonderful starter house? Of course, Mikey. I have brick blocks and they are in storage in my house. We can go and I will be able to give them to you as much as you need to complete the construction of your house. Uh, okay, in that case, let's go there right now. We don't have a minute to waste. And so we have already come to my house. But wait a minute, Mikey, what is it? Look into the distance. It's some kind of strange portal and there is a wandering villager next to it. It's very interesting. Let's go there right now. Of course, JJ. Let's go and find out what's going on there. It seems a wandering villager has brought an unusual thing. We need to find out from him what it is and what may be inside this unusual portal. Just look at it. It's big enough and unusual. I wonder where it can lead us. I've never seen anything like it. And where does this traveling merchant get all these things from? It will now be much more interesting than practicing before the competitions of builders of the starter house between the villagers. And so, hey, 
Hi guys, it looks like you're JJ and Mikey. My name is Bob and I'm a traveling merchant. It looks like you're interested in the portal that I brought from faraway places. Oh, that's right. We came to find out what it is. It looks just amazing and unusual. This is a realistic rainbow portal. The entrance here costs 10 emeralds. There are various realistic dimensions inside it. If you want to get there, first pay. Okay, no problem. Hey, Mikey, I only have five emeralds with me. Do you have five more so that we can go inside the portal? Oh, yes, I found it. I also have five emeralds. Okay, traveling merchant, take 10 emeralds to enter. Great, thanks for the emeralds, guys. Oh, yeah, and one more thing. I do not guarantee that you will be able to return back and never let the animals of this world into this portal. Understand? Oh, of course we get you, traveling merchant. Don't let any animals into your rainbow realistic portal. Look, it's a cat. Where did she come from here? I hope she doesn't want to jump right into the portal. Hey, cat, you definitely can't enter inside the portal. Oh, my God. Hey, JJ, this cat jumped right into the portal. We urgently need to jump after him to get him out of there. He can't be there. Rather, ran to teleport JJ. I'm shocked how this cat could jump into this portal. JJ and Mikey help bring him back. Otherwise, it will end in very bad things. Okay, we'll do it. I'm in complete shock, okay? I'm jumping into the portal. One hour later. Oh my god, Mikey. That blow was very soft. Hey, where did we fall with you? Where are we right now? I'm in complete shock. I can't believe my eyes. Hey. Wow, JJ. It looks like we ended up in exactly the place that the traveling merchant was talking about. We appeared in the real world. Wow, that's exactly how JJ... I can't believe it, okay? In that case, we need to be careful. Our task is also to find the cat that jumped into the portal. He should be here somewhere. Hmm, but I don't see him here right now. Look how realistic everything here is. It looks like we got into someone's room and we're standing on someone's bed. Wow! Yeah, okay, let's start looking for the missing cat. Okay, JJ, we need to get off this bed to look around the whole room. Jump after me. Let's start looking for this cat. I'm sure we'll find it. Yes, and I hope so too. Okay, let's start with that part of the room. Okay, let's looking, but whoa, stop, Mikey. Look at this realistic mouse. Hey, where is it running to? Run away immediately. I do not know where he came from, but he wants to eat me. Please, please run away from him now. Do you hear? Whoa, what did that mouse say? Who was he running from right now? Oh my god, you see it too, Mikey. It's a realistic cat, and I think I figured out what kind of cat it is. I can't believe it. Oh, yes. It's our cat from our Minecraft world. It seems when he jumped into this portal, he expanded into the most real and realistic cat from the real world. Hey, and he doesn't want to eat or play with us. I don't like his look, JJ. Oh, yes. It looks like you were right, Mikey. Rather, run away from this evil cat. I'm shocked he wants to play or eat us. Why did he become so gigantic and we are small? We urgently need to escape from him. Otherwise, he will catch up with us faster. Mikey, we need some kind of escape plan. I found a way out. I have a ladder. I put it on this big sofa. Rather, JJ climb on it. This aggressive cat won't be able to get us on it. I'm sure of it. Phew, Mikey, we were finally able to break away from this cat. I still can't believe that this is exactly our cat from our Minecraft world. How did he become like this? That's what the traveling merchant was talking about when he forbade any animals to jump into this rainbow realistic portal. And it can really be dangerous for those who live in this real world, okay? I don't even have any ideas how to return it to our Minecraft world. One hour later. Okay, it's good that we found you again. A real mouse from the real world? It seems we've all climbed high enough. This cat from our Minecraft world won't get us here. I hope so. Okay, guys, I'll help you. I have a potion with which you can go back, but for that, I'll ask for a piece of delicious real cheese. Hey, it seems I have such a mouse. You can take it away, and you will give us this potion. We urgently need to return to our Minecraft world. Wow, this is a real delicious piece of cheese. Thanks, guys. I'm so hungry. Okay, take your potion and come back and take your cat. He wanted to eat me and I definitely don't like him. Okay, no problem. Thanks for the mouse's help. We ran back to our world right now. Hopefully we'll try to bring our already realistic cat back to our world. Good luck.
Okay, Mikey, let's rather use the potion to put up a portal and finally go back. Our cat must regain the same appearance that he originally had when he jumps into the portal, so everything should work. Great! And here's our portal, okay? We just have to wait for a realistic cat and jump right into it. Um, Mikey, turn around immediately. It seems it's him. We need to run away from here urgently. Okay, he came for us. Rather JJ jump right into the portal, he should follow us. Let's do it. I'm afraid that he will be faster than we teleport faster. Oh my god, how unlucky they are with this cat. How good it is that I was left here alone with my piece of delicious cheese. Hey, if they would come more often to give me such delicious cheese, maybe I would make friends with them. Phew! Finally, Mikey, we managed to get back. Now the cat has to teleport in his usual form. It was a fun journey, but dangerous. Oh, yes! I agree with you, JJ. It was dangerous. Oh, no! Why didn't it work? Why didn't he turn into an ordinary, normal cat? Hey, it seems he wants to eat me. Go ahead, stupid villager. Now you will give us all your emeralds because we are the main bandits here and you will do what we tell you. Clear your pockets. All the jewelry should already be with us. Do it faster, fool. Oh my god. Guys, please don't touch me. I'll give everything I have. I only have my emeralds with me. You can take them away. Just leave me alone. Okay? I don't want any problems. My life is important to me. In that case, you will give everything you have if you have enough jewelry. Then we will leave you alone. And if not, we will have to deal with you. I got it. Here it is. This is all I have. I hope you are satisfied with so many emeralds. Okay, well done. I think that's enough. You're lucky. Maybe you'll survive. A few moments later... Oh yes, Mikey! Today is a great day to trade with the villagers. We need to buy some groceries. I need a good enchanted diamond hoe. If we find a villager who can sell it to us, it will be very oh cool. Oh my god, hey! You see this, JJ? Forget about the diamond hoe and look down. I thought this was not possible in our village. I'm in complete shock. What should we do right now, JJ? I'm scared. It looks like the villager is being robbed by some bandits right now. It seems they are well armed. Rather, take out your phone and call the police. Otherwise, they may kill the villager. I've already got my phone out. I'm dialing the police. She should be here any minute. Whoa! Hey, look, Mikey! And here's a police car. They arrived very quickly. Okay, let's see how they're going to capture these bandits. Hey, the officers of the bandits are right there. Rather, stop them. Okay, guys, make way. Let's run. Hey, it's the police. Immediately put your hands up and surrender. You're surrounded for robbery. Stop right now. Oh, my God, it's the police. We're running away as soon as she arrived at the wrong time. You can't catch up with us. Whew! I'm in shock! The officers chased right after the robbers. We managed to save the villager. He seems to be in complete shock. I hope the police can catch up with them and arrest them. Hmm. Hey, Mikey. Look, they left their police car. It looks just amazing. Oh, yes. I agree, JJ. These cops are so cool. I like their work and what they do. They catch criminals. I also want to try to be a police officer. I also like their work and what they do. Maybe we'll borrow their car and uniforms from the officers for a while so that we can become real cops. I think they won't mind it. Wow, cool idea. JJ, okay, let's do it. It's time to become real officers. The next day. Whew, and so enough time has passed and we were finally able to become real officers. Look how amazing it is, Mikey. We now have weapons, our own police uniforms. We also have a real police car in which we can go on a call if necessary. And we also built a real cage for criminals. Those who we catch will be here. Now this is our improvised prison for different bandits. Oh yeah, JJ. I'm so excited to become a real officer. I can't wait to catch some criminal and put him in our prison. We'll do it together as real cop partners. Oh yeah. That's right, Mikey. Hey, let's go patrol our village. Talk to the villagers in case they know something about bandits. Meanwhile... Great. My new potion will be just perfect. If I cook it, everything will work out. Whoa, stop. Is that a cat? Hey, cute kitty, where did you find my shack from? I think it's better for you not to be here. We can drop something or do something. You better get out of here. Hey, do you hear me, annoying cat? Hey, why did you get into my cauldron in which my new potion is brewed? Oh my god, this is not going to end well. I do not know what will happen to you now. I can't believe my potion turned you into a real cat. 
I'm shocked how it works on animals. Okay, cat, don't do that anymore. Let me use my other potion to return you to your previous appearance. Oh my god! No, the potion didn't work the way it was supposed to. Why are you purple now? Okay, it seems like it was for nothing. Hey, stop the cat. I need to bring you back to your previous state. Hey. One hour later. And so villagers, you must remember that we are cops now. We patrol the village from dangerous criminals. Have you seen anything suspicious lately, mm -hmm. hmm? It seems that nothing has happened lately. Everything is calm except for the purple cat. Wait, who is this from? Where did he come here? Whoa, wait for the purple realistic cat. Am I hallucinating or is it really just like that? JJ, hey, I'm shocked what he's doing in our world. It's very strange. Okay, thanks, villagers. Go ahead, Mikey. We have to follow this strange cat. I think something is wrong here. There are definitely no such cats, especially realistic ones in our world. We need to find out what kind of cat it is. Okay, it seems he's running straight towards my house, rather before he disappears from our field of vision. We have to catch up with him at all costs, because we're cops. Okay, it seems we almost caught him. Hey, strange cat, what happened to you? It's very strange. We've really never seen anything like this. Maybe he's sick with something, don't you think, Mikey? Whoa, stop. Hey, what's going on with him? It looks like he's turning into something. Hey, stop. Mikey, you also see what I see. It's a mutated catnap. How is this possible? JJ, I'm in shock. I can't move. I'm very scared. Okay, Mikey, I think now the only solution is to run as far as possible because he definitely wants to eat us sooner. Mikey, I'm shocked he's so scary and huge with big claws faster. Rather, JJ, we run as long as possible. We need to hide from him or try to climb somewhere higher. Otherwise, he will kill us faster. One hour later. Get a nasty catnap. Oh my god, I spent all my arrows, but they are too weak to damage him. And Mikey Kudato hid. I hope he's okay. I climbed into our cage and hope that he definitely won't be able to get me here for a while. I need to come up with a plan to escape from the scary catnap. Whoa, stop, is that Mikey? Hey, I'm in complete shock. It's him and he's flying on wings. Could he really find a way to make this scary mutated cat couldn't get you? Hooray, finally. Whoa, hey JJ, I was able to find you. It's good that you're okay. I was able to find these wings and fireworks. Let me land on this big cage with you. I found a way how we can defeat Catnap, but you'll have to do it, JJ. Only you can do it. Wow, seriously, and what kind of plan is this? I'm very scared. We need to act very quickly before Catnap gets here to us and destroys us. Wow, what is this? TNT and a lighter. Do you want me to blow it up? Yes, that's right. Take my wings. You will go down, fending off his attacks. You will set fire to TNT, and it will explode. You should succeed, JJ. We are cops. We must save the village. Okay, Mikey. I flew. I hope your plan works. Hey, nasty catnap. It's me, JJ. Try to catch me. I'm sure you won't succeed. It looks like you're really angry and hungry. Try to eat my TNT for breakfast. Wow, that was unrealistically cool, JJ. It seems he's neutralized. Rather dragging him into our cage, he lost forever. Hooray, now Catnap has been arrested and will be in this prison. He lost this battle. Mikey, I like being cops. It's insanely fun, but also dangerous. This mutated cat almost destroyed us. Yes, but we still managed to defeat him. And now he will be sitting in this cage, and we save the village and ourselves, hooray!